Hi everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how you can boost the volume of your plug and play USB mic. Now you've probably come across this problem over the last few years if you've been playing around with podcasting or Skype and stuff like that and you'll go into your system settings down here and you'll open the sound settings and you'll get to 100 and you think no the mic is still too quiet what can I do don't worry I want to put all the links for all the stuff you need to do down below but I got the information from this guy tech it out and I'll put a link down to this video and his channel in my YouTube uh, video description and I'll put a link to the programs we're going to use as well but it's dead easy all you do is you cl click on the links and you go over to SourceForge and you download and install a program called Equalizer APO just download it install it I think you run it but but nothing really happens but you also need to download and install a program called Peace Equalizer and you download and install and, and run this again and nothing much will happen I mean, in fact it won't work if it does fire up nothing will happen because you need to restart your PC because Equalizer APO works at a system level to change the inputs of your, your USB mic and then and what Peace uh, Equalizer does is that is a graphical interface that allows you to easily adjust the settings in the equalizer. But anyway, when you've when you've downloaded everything and you've restarted your PC, you'll end up with uh, a, this Peace icon on your on your uh, desktop. So just fire it up, and this is where the magic begins. And you, you, I couldn't believe this when I did. I can't believe it works. I've I've struggled with USB mics for ages. You can click on the full interface. And what you can see at the top of the screen here, this is a, this is basically a gain slider in decibels. And let, let me just show you. So if I start counting, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. See how it got louder and quieter without me having to adjust anything. I'm recording this little tutorial in an OBS. We can make it quieter. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. Is that what it, how it goes? The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. Quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. How cool is that? And basically, we've solved the problems. Now, I've this was to probably start to distort because I'm rec again I'm recording this with OBS, and in OBS it does have a microphone booster, so I've got that set to three, I think, on my USB mic. Um, so as I pump this up, it will it probably will start to distort. <coughs> but normally somewhere between a d uh, amplification of 10 decibels and 14 decibels can be useful if you go too high it will start to distort like you'll probably start hearing it to distort now um, it's probably crackling and sounding pretty awful um, so let's go back to down here where it should sound fairly reasonable now the reason I think why USB mics are so low is the fact that they don't have or if it doesn't have any gain control on the mic it needs to be set very low to start off with doesn't it because it doesn't know how loud your voice is going to be so they have to set it so that it won't won't clip so so there we go problem solved when, when you say done um we say save and then you can save that conference and say done that's it that is set this is playing with the registry uh, of your computer which is changing the input volumes at a system level so this will then apply to skype it'll apply to screencast it'll apply to anywhere when you're recording <coughs> a uh, recording something with with this particular um, with this particular mic um, in fact actually you can set it for individual things as well let me put that down there audio USB which is the one we're worried about um, and uh, yeah it's, it's 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 really cool now the other the next step actually I mean that's probably enough and you probably go oh wow that's great the next step is you can have different presets down here so if for example I um, change this preset down here you should start to hear my voice has probably changed a little bit to sound quite different let's try the telephone one let's see how this one changes and again as you can see it's really playing with the um, the different levels of the different the gain of different frequencies in my voice as we go through um, Bluetooth. <laughs> I'm, not sure. I'm no expert on equalization when it comes to vocals, so you probably hear different things. Now, I've got one saved here. Now, the volume is probably going to go really loud, loud now, called Bass Boost Xbox. 
because when I'm using my Ava Media LGP light capture device, the, the volume is, is too quiet. So I have to really boost it up. Um, and combined with the fact that OBS is boosting this up, this will probably sound really distorted. So let's just go back to bass boost. And the idea with bass boost is that it's just pumping up the low end a little bit on my voice. So there we go. Problem solved. Um, just go to those links, install those programs, restart your PC, fire up um, piece, and um, your low volume, your low input USB mic problems are solved forever. God, this is so good. I wish I'd had this years and years ago. Oh, dear me. Anyway, that's enough from me. Thank you very much for watching. If this video is useful, hit the like button, subscribe if you want to see more of the same. And uh, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see you again soon.